Yo, 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 agents. Welcome. If you're enjoying the free content, please like and subscribe to try and help the channel grow. Thank you. This is going to be my build video number 10. It's going to be a hybrid build. Just going to do a quick demo of what it can do on the uh, Federal Emergency Bunker on Heroic. So let's go. There's plenty of different variations of this. I'm using a shield, but if you want to get the full benefit of the capacitor, then you can use the drone or the turret or the seeker mine. Choice is yours. It's got some lovely healing. Let's have a look at the heals. Very nice. Alright, let's get into the build. So today, hybrid, two red cores, one blue core, five yellow cores, starting with a mask, one piece grouper, that gives us plus 15% crit hit damage, the core attributes, I've rolled on here one skill tier, 12% crit hit damage, 6% crit hit chance, 11.9 crit hit damage. For the chest, we're running two piece providence, the chest and the knee pads, that gives us plus 15% headshot damage, 10% crit hit chance. The core attribute, 15% weapon damage, 20% repair skills, 12% crit hit damage, 6% crit hit chance. For the talent, obliterate. Critical hits increase total weapon damage by 1% for 5 seconds, it stacks up to a very nice 25 times. For the holster, 1 piece Seska, that gives us plus 10% crit hit chance. For the core attribute, I've rolled on here 1 skill tier, 18.8 repair skills, 12% crit hit damage. For the knee pads, I've rolled for the core attribute 1 skill tier, 6% crit hit chance, 20% repair skills. For the gloves, 1 piece Alp Summit, plus 20% repair skills. For the core attribute, plus 1 skill tier, 20% repair skills, 12% crit hit damage. And for the backpack, the magical Memento Exotic. Core attribute, 15% weapon damage, 170,000 armor, 1 skill tier, 12% crit hit damage. For the talent, it's a beautiful talent for most builds, even skill builds. Kill confirmed. Enemies you kill drop a trophy on death. Collecting trophies provide both a short and long term buff, the first of which scales with the number of core attributes equipped and lasts 10 seconds. So we've got two reds, so that gives us plus 10% weapon damage. We've got one blue, so that gives us plus 10% bonus armor. We've got six yellow, so that gives us 30% skill efficiency. And for the second part, for every trophy collected, gain an additional plus 1% weapon damage, plus 1% skill efficiency, and 0 0.1 armor regen for 300 seconds. Stacks up to 30 times. For the skills, I've gone for the Crusader Shield. Cooldown, 16.8 seconds. The health, beautiful 5.1 million. Active regen, 63,000. Holstered regen, 95,000. It's skill tier 6, so we get plus 60% active regen, plus 250,000 uh, shield health, 250% uh, shield health, plus 40% holstered regen. For my second, I've gone for the Reinforcer Chem Launcher, 9 ammo, cooldown is 25.2 seconds, the radius is 4.8 meters, the duration is 6.4 seconds, the ally repair, repair 985,000, one press and you're back at full armor, beautiful. Repair over time, 197,000. This is skill tier 6, so you get plus 6 ammo, 60% radius, plus 120% heal. Very nice. For the weapons, I've gone for the Capacitor Exotic Assault Rifle. 
a very nice total damage 115.8 thousand RPM 700 41 in the magazine 15% assault rifle damage 11% damage to armor 9.5 health damage the talent capacitance the first bit of this talent we're not using but like I say if you want to use turrets or any kind of skill when you get to 40 stacks you'll get an extra 60% skill damage very nice this is the one I'm using it for for each yellow skill tier gain 7.5 weapon damage very nice for my second I've gone for the SIG MPX total damage 95.1 RPM of 850 50 in the magazine the core attribute 15% SMG damage 19.5 crit hit chance 10% damage to target out of cover and the talent strained Gain 10% crit hit damage for every 0.5 seconds you are firing. Stacks up to a very nice 5 times. For my sidearm, you can use whatever you want. I've gone for the TDI card custom. 176.3 thousand damage. 310 RPM. 18 in the magazine. 12.6 pistol damage. Plus 1 skill tier. And the talent, breadbasket. Landing body shots adds a stack of bonus plus 35% headshot damage to the next headshot. For 10 seconds max stack is three let's have a look at the stats for the capacitor weapon damage for six skill tier 115,000 beautiful PvP weapon damage 46,000 crit hit chance is nearly maxed out at 58% crit hit damage 161.9 headshot damage 90% armor damage 11% 10% health damage and for the MPX Weapon damage is 95,000. PvP weapon damage is 30,000. The crit hit chance is maxed out at 60. The crit hit damage, a very nice 141,000. Plus, don't forget you get another 50% uh, uh, from strained. Headshot damage is 85%. Very nice. Uh, for the specialization, I've gone for technician. This is just for the one skill tier. Okay, agents, that'll do it for today. Thanks for watching. Hopefully see you in the next one. Peace out.